Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to um, add a news article or a blog post and we'll use those gymnastics results that you sent. So hover over new and click post. Okay, to make the text bigger to give it a title, so just highlight everything and then this drop down menu, click heading 1, and then you've got heading 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 in there, which is different, uh, all different sizes of text. And the best way to probably um, display your results is to turn the Word document into a PDF unless you wanted to type it out yourself. So first of all on the right hand side <clears throat> we've got the publish button which once we've uh, created the page will turn into update and on, also we've got categories here so you've got latest news, fundraising and I'm going to add a new category and call it competition results and then in future that category will stay there and this list will just keep growing um, so as you add more results throughout the year and next year um, you just tick a box you can tick as many boxes as you want so click publish okay and then next we need to upload the PDF file and turn this text here into a link so, right, left hand side, we've got media. I'm going to add new. And I've already created the PDF for this. And as you can see, um, if, when you're creating a PDF file or any file that you're uploading, if you can eliminate any spaces you've got and turn it into a hash. Okay, once that's uploaded, click edit. And on the right hand side here, we've got the URL basically where the PDF file has, has gone. Um, where it's uh, been put into a folder in within the website so just highlight it right click and copy and then we're going to go back and find the post that we've created so click on post latest competition results and we'll click edit and then we're going to highlight that turn it into a link and then the little icon just click on that paste in and then because it's a PDF um, we'd want when people click on it we'll give them the opportunity to download it so tick the little box here add the link click update and then we'll view the post and now you can see we've also that the uh, latest news on the right hand side um, it has dropped in into there as well now you can see there's the PDF and then on the right hand side again and I'll show you you can add some images in there if you wanted to and also, uh, once you're logged in, it will actually be your username that um, 
appears on there. So click edit post. And I'm going to drop um, a random image in there that's on my PC. Upload files. And we'll drop that slider in there. It's probably too large. Um, and then on the right hand side, you've got the opportunity to have it quite small or reduce the size of it or have a full size. So for the purpose of this, we'll just put medium. Once the blue tick has arrived in the box, <coughs> click insert to post. <clears throat> click update now you can see we dropped an image in there as well and to delete it just click on it so it goes blue that's that done.